guys so i have some bread here for the chickies this one's literally about to jump in my lap but i just wanted to feed them some regular sliced bread for them and just bond with them i had some corn earlier but it's actually really nice and relaxing to just sit here and um with my chickens and just bond with them even if it's as simple as feeding them sorry if i sound out of breath i have to chase my smaller dog in the backyard because of course he never listens but we all know that so yeah so here we are we're about to just bond with my chickens basically get them to trust me and eat from my hand because i feel like a lot of them just are still a little bit skittish but slowly they're eating more and more So if I can get them to come a little closer and we can have a little bonding moment together, me and my babies. Oh, she almost took my thumb. Okay, don't be afraid. Okay, okay. There you go. We've also got a couple in the back that are a little skittish to come out here and try some bread. <laughs> my one chicken, my favorite girl, she's making weird sounds. Look at this white one. This white one, guys, never used to come this close to me. Never. We still have a couple that are skittish, but... Slowly and surely. Oops. We'll get them all to come here and... Check what's going on and eat from my hand. Um, my youngest female, actually one of the young females that was hatched last year. Um, actually the only female that was hatched last year, but she ate from my hand today. Actually, I think it was today. It's corn or something. I don't remember what it was. She ate something. Or maybe it wasn't today. It was probably a few days ago. I don't remember. This black one over there is a little bit more skittish. Come here, rooster. See, look at the black one, guys. She almost ate from my hand. I'm trying to get him. This white one, though, is wanting to eat all of them. Girl, you've got to share. You <laughs> share. Good boy, see? This is nice. The black one just ate from my hand. She's done it before too. Okay, can we slow down? Okay. There, gotta share. Oh, the rooster just ate from my hand. Hello, here, buddy. Here, it's okay. You can have it. You are like a little piranha. chicken missing yeah there's one behind me you are just an eager beaver this chicken guys this white one used to be so skittish now i feel like she doesn't give a rat's behind huh. come here you gotta share with your sisters making sure everybody gets some oh good boy See, I didn't get to bond with my rooster, the dad rooster, who's no longer with us, as much as I got to bond with these guys. 
just because I feel like but these ones are more like mellow and hopefully when I do find homes that they aren't the craziest their dad was but nonetheless guys believe me if I had land and was it was okay to have roosters here see look at him he's so friendly I would keep all my roosters I would have kept the dad also even though he's a jerk I would have kept them too yeah it's just look at this girl right here are you just gonna eat all of the bread yes she is <laughs> they're just so precious here oh you're a tough rooster now aren't you oh this crazy hairstyle guy oh girl come on okay we're on it This white hen, guys, she is crazy. <laughs> Come here. Got a little bit of bread left. Oh, you're pretty. I think it's supposed to rain tomorrow, so that sucks. But I guess it is what it is. Oh, hi. Here you go, pretty. Got a lot of crumbs on me. Oh, 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 don't knock the camera over. Thank you. Hey, buddy. Okay. Good girl. Here, here, here. You see, guys, this rooster. Alrighty, since you're just a hogger, trying to hog all of the food, you're a pretty girl. Come here, come here, boys. Oh, good boy. Oh. That was it, guys. Just decided to feed them a little bit of bread and just bond with them. They're doing quite good. Look at her. Oh, there's no more. I know. There's no more. I'll see what I can give them tomorrow because they had a corn today and tomorrow I'll give them something else. Um, I'll hold this hen here. She actually fell on my lap when I was holding her a couple days ago. She's the easiest one to catch, so that's why I'm always holding her. And she's the one who really stays close to me and is not skittish. I hope you guys can hear me. I hope it's not too loud or I'm too quiet. See, I love these roosters here too. Hi, there's nothing here for you. Nothing, I know. Look at him, he's like so curious. You're so curious. He looks more like his dad. The guy with the without the crazy hairstyle like this one right here is the one with the crazy hairstyle who still kind of reminds me of his dad the, the look on his face he's like the same look his dad did but like he's got the crazy hair he's got the feathered legs not as um intense i should say oops sorry guys I'm trying to make sure that you can see this hen here She is a sweetheart. I'm gonna make it more of a mission to bond with the chickens. It's just before when I had that rooster, it was kind of hard to bond with him because he would attack and I'd always have to watch my back. But now that these young boys haven't attacked me yet, hopefully they don't. Um, it's so easy to be in here. It's nice that I don't have to watch my back. You know, I can turn my back towards them and they don't attack. And they're here close to me. They're getting more friendly. They're actually literally right in front of me right now. But I just wanted to turn the camera so you guys can see her. She likes this. <clears throat> She's my favorite girl. Yes, you are. 
gotta put some medicine in their bowl. Keep forgetting. But I'll, I'll just I'll get some medicine and put it in after um I finish here. Huh, babies? Oh yeah. There's nothing here. Yeah, you eat all of it. Yes, you did. You are so beautiful. You guys, if you have chickens or are thinking of getting chickens, I definitely suggest it. Make sure you look where, if they allow roosters in your area. But if you can't have roosters, even just having hens, just girls. Um, hens is what you call girls, or rooster is what you call a boy. But having just chickens in general is so relaxing and fun. You can get all kinds of neat looking birds. There's really unique colored birds out there. And they even do lay different colored eggs, not just the regular white eggs or just brown eggs. They even lay like green eggs, um, dark, dark brown eggs, blue eggs, all kinds. And if they're a mixed breed, like chances are they'll be laying some very unique colored eggs. You can even hatch a couple of your own babies if you wanted. Um, it's really cool. Like this one over here, you, if she'll get on camera a little bit. She's a very pretty. She's got the same hairstyle as one of the mom birds. But she's got a very unique grayish black color to her. It's like a black splash. I don't know. I'm not too like professional on chicken breeds. But yeah. <clears throat> and here is this pretty girl. Don't mind these shoes. These are some ugly shoes that we use in the backyard. Because you know when you have animals. Yeah, you just use whatever shoes that aren't, you know, you don't want to use your fancy shoes when you have chickens and all these things. When you're doing work, at least. Or just in your backyard in general. But as I was saying, if you can get chickens, I definitely suggest getting them. Because like I said, you can get really pretty looking colored eggs from them. They all taste the same. You can get different colored chickens, different breeds, all that. And it's fun. And roosters, like are basically nice to have too if you can have rooster in your area if you can it's not the best thing to get but you know and egg and chickens will um the females will lay eggs even without a rooster so you don't need a rooster the only time you'll need a rooster is if you want to hatch some eggs or if you want a rooster to protect the flock basically but that would be the only reason to ever consider getting one Look at this chicky. She's falling asleep. <clears throat> so this is fun. I think I'm going to do more videos like this. Just sitting and talking with you guys. She's falling asleep. I don't know if you can see it on camera. But her right eye looks closed. I can't see her left. But she's enjoying this. It's almost actually time for them to go in bed and sleep. In about an hour and a half or so. Um, yeah. I love chickens. Chickens are just the best chickens ever. I love them. So uh, one day when I do move out, um, I would love to get like a farm or something with land. It doesn't have to be a lot of land. Just a place with maybe at least two acres is fine with me. Because again, I don't like doing backyard work really. At least I haven't. Maybe when I get my own place I will. But for now... I'm just not the biggest fan. Sorry, I'm trying to get her comfortable. It's okay, Mama. You can sit. Yep, sit, sit, sit. I'm not the biggest fan of, like, you know, doing a lot of construction work in the backyard or any of that. But I do love chickens. So if I get a place with at least two acres of land, um, I can get chickens. And I can get more chickens in different breeds, different colors. I can get roosters again because I won't have to get rid of them. Um, yeah. For me, when I get a pet, I believe it should be forever. It doesn't matter what it is. But since I live in my family's mom's house with her husband, it's their rules. They didn't want the male rooster. They got rid of him. They don't want these ones. We have to get rid of them. The males, at least. I'm trying to convince her to keep the females. She's going on and off about keeping them. Yes and no. But so far, I think we are for the females. Just gonna have to. I want to build another setup for them. Hopefully, I can find a job soon so I can pay with my own money to buy the wood and do all that. Because for the doghouse that we have, I paid for all the wood for that. So that was nice. 
um, the metal roof we already had. But for all the other stuff, I paid for. All the wood and all that stuff. So yeah. I'm just really happy with this chicken, guys. And all my chickens. They're just so beautiful. Even the ones that passed away, I will never forget them. Never ever. So if you guys have the space, the time, and you have the love for chickens or want to know what it's like having them, I say start with females first. Have them for a couple of years. We had females for a couple of years and then got our first last year, I believe. And our first rooster last year. And I love it. I just love having chickens. Even though we'll be having just the girls, that'll be okay. It'll give me more time to bond with them. And I have way too many roosters, guys. I have seven chickens, seven females, hens, whatever. Seven hens and three roosters. Too many roosters for a group of hens. Three roosters would be fine if you have, like, say, 20 plus birds. Because, you know, they have multiple girls to look after. But three is a lot of stress on, on seven hens. So I don't suggest doing this. My first time breeding them, I will not breed them again. Ever, really. I don't think until I move out or something. Look at her beautiful feathers. Yes, you are a gorgeous girl. You are so pretty. Should we have a close-up? You are so pretty. Look at her, you guys. Just look at her real quick. She wants to run off, but look where they are right now. Over here, chilling. Here's the rooster. Where is he? Right there. <coughs> I'm gonna say something till I end up almost choking. <coughs> so, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. It was a little bit different, but I just wanted to sit, barn with my chickens, talk to you guys, and I'll be doing more of these. If you have any questions about roosters, chickens, hens, you want me to do more things about them, let me know. I enjoy doing it. So, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video.